All right. Well, let's get started. Uh, I'd like to welcome our first performer, who is actually Gifting Pride's very own founder and CEO, Karen Robertson. Welcome. Hey. Good to Good see morning. you. Good morning. Good to see you. Oh, yes, rainbow flag. Day. Yes, yes, yes. Have to have that in the background. Have to yeah. So yeah. tell us a little bit about yourself and Gifting Pride. Well, Gifting Pride came out of a time where I was, I kind of explained that in my first song, but the, I came out of a time when I was uh, kind of searching for the, the right path for me to move forward and uh, saw a bunch of songwriters, you know, out there who who could write great songs, but um, needed a way to to get on and, and, and write custom songs for people. So we created Gifting Pride and that's what I'm about. Um, I'm also a college music professor. Um, and that's fun and totally different. So it's a good time. <laughs> awesome. Uh, so what does coming out day mean to you? You know, I didn't know uh, <laughs> I didn't know coming out day existed until about 10 years ago. And maybe it didn't. Maybe it's a new thing. I don't really know. But I yeah, think that's for in our me, trivia. So good. Our, oh, coming I, I trivia. Will, it's one of our questions. I, I wonder if I give myself 10% for a song. Oh, anyway. Back to this, uh, you know, a, a coming out day for me, I think it's difficult to come out. And I think it's also something that everyone does every day. It's not like a one time thing. You have to still kind of tell people, even at my age, you know, you have to sometimes come out to people. And I think the good thing about coming out day is that it makes the space for you to do that a safe space to say, look at this, you know, this is what we're all doing together. We're going to support each other as we go through it. And uh, so I think it's a really great day, especially for us to have a gala for sure. Yeah, especially because Gifting Pride is coming out today. Yes, right. Okay, so I watched a little of your of your video in advance. I cheated. Sorry, everyone. I, I am the host. I get uh, pre-release uh, access. Um, so I know most, uh, you tell us a lot about the songs, but you mentioned that you don't say any of the names of the songs. So do you want to tell correct. us what the names are? Uh, hmm, let me, let me think if I can remember. Um, uh, yeah. So the first one is, uh, you never know. And, uh, the second song is, uh, love turned her wheel. The third song is sweet baby boy. And the fourth one is a million, sh million shells along the beach. Awesome. Uh, anything else we should know before we move on? I don't think so. I'm, I'm looking forward to the day and I'm glad you all are all here to, to shell, celebrate with us. And I will be back again later for the gala. And I just hope you all stay on to hear all these fantastic songwriters we have coming up. And I'll see you in a minute. Awesome. Thanks so much, Karen. Uh, reminder, new uh, new overlay. If you would like to donate to Karen, who's donating her time, uh, you can donate to her at the link uh, uh, below um, and her PayPal link. So let's let's take it away. Do, do, do. Share audio. Important. All right. I'm going to take us off. I am the founder of Gifting Pride, and I'm so happy that you're here today. And I hope that you stay with us throughout the entire day and that you have a great time. We've got some great songwriters for you. They're very talented, and they're such great people. So we're glad that you're here to hear them and uh, to support them as we support uh, great causes. And um, so I'm going to start with a song that actually, uh, in many ways, began this whole thought process um, for Gifting Pride. I was in kind of a rough place in March, as many people were, struggling with how do I move forward? What do I do with uh, life in general? Where am I headed? And uh, this song came to me, and it was really quite helpful in many ways uh, for moving me onward and then and breaking me open so that I could think about the concept of gifting pride.
blood and you're not gonna take it anymore you say everyone has got it better than me i'm scratching and clawing and staring at closed doors you gotta wait for the good to come it's moving and shaking and calling itself on just reach out to your heart to find her the key to love the lost note in the code because you never know this day is giving you and how it's gonna move you forward. You never know what this world is coming to and how it's gonna bring a new song in your life. something new so now's the time to release let go into the rising flow if causing it beckons you into peace the winds of change are moving you on hold on my friend and you see it only takes a moment in time to call your foot forward and move you into peace cause you never know this day is giving you and how it's gonna move you forward do you never know what this world is coming to and how it's gonna bring a new song in your life I enjoy as being a part of Gifting Pride and actually for writing songs for people for a while now is really talking to them to get to know them to find out what it is they want in their songs um, and you know I meet some really great people that way I'm able to uh, talk to them and just uh, get to know new people and uh, you know so if you if you decide that you want to purchase a song through Gifting Pride we always interview you to find out what it is you want. You know, if it's for your grandfather or uh, your best friend or if it's for a memorial, we always uh, research who you are and then we bring that into the song to make it very special. So I wrote this song uh, a few months ago for a couple and I really liked them quite a bit. They, they really knew themselves. They knew each other very well. And uh, so it made for some, some interesting talk um, some little tidbits I was able to throw into the song, and I want to sing it for you now. Living 
kind of a fun song that I like quite a bit um, that I wrote for a little baby whose name is Henry and his family's told me that uh, that he kind of laughs and also cries kind of like a dinosaur so they called him Henry Saurus that was his nickname and I just love that um, I love the way that it bounced along and and the funness of it and so I hope you enjoy the song
that's an enjoyable and sometimes it's an enjoyable song and sometimes I just uh, don't know where it's going to take me. So it's always fun though. I'm going to end with a song um, that I wrote for a special someone and she knows who she is. Enjoy the rest of the day. Enjoy your gala. Awesome. Thanks so much for sharing everything today with us. Thank you. I had a great time making that. <laughs>